Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, just hopping on today to do a little bit of an update um, on some projects that I've been working on. Uh, today I just wanted to give you um, a sneak peek on the buffet that I purchased uh, for $10 at the 10 mile yard sale. Um, so I'm going to turn the camera around and give you guys a peek. Okay, so this is uh, what I've got so far. Um, this is um, a couple coats of paint. And um, I still have the underneath to do and um, another coat on the back. Uh, but so far, um, I think it's looking fantastic compared to what it looked like when I got it. Uh, I still am not sure, um, I think I'm going to do the inside of the drawers here, uh, either with, uh, contact paper or some kind of a liner, um, this one has these separators that go in here and there's three of them to section it off for, uh, silverware or whatever. Um, yeah, so I think it's coming out really good so far. Um, and then this little beauty over here, I'm still working on. Uh, so far, all I really did is put a coat of um, white chalk paint on it. and But I'm not leaving it white. Uh, what I want to do is try to match this like cream color I guess you could call it it's like a cream color tan um, that's the color that I want to do the bottom so sooner or later I will find a paint color that I like all right so that's it for that little beauty so as far as those two furniture pieces, that's as far as I've gotten. Um, I'm almost done though, and I'll be glad to be done. And uh, I'm going to keep the kitchen, okay. but I'm pretty sure I'm going to sell the buffet. And I have a couple other items in the house that um, I'm going to show you also um, and just get your opinion on. So I'll see you in a minute. Well, I'm back. And um, the two farmhouse signs that you see there. Uh, if you remember in the last video, um, the writing and the border on both of these were different colors. One was in red and the other was in blue, which I hated. So I painted it in black and I think it came out really nice. Um, I'm still not sure if I want to whitewash the existing uh, wood color um, I think I'm just going to leave them the way they are. Um, I'd like to know what everybody thinks about them from the before and after. Um, and this little bench here, if you recall, um, I uh, got and I painted it up in some chalk paint and distressed it. And I think it came out really, really, really cute. Box with the handle um, was given to me uh, by a very dear friend. And she had uh, four potted violet plants in it. And what I did was, is I repainted it, I distressed it, and then I covered the handle in jute twine, made a little jute twine flower with a button, button center. And then I did the mason jars in chalk paint uh, set the paint in the oven for an hour. Uh, I preheated the oven to 200 degrees, put the jars in the oven for one hour and let them cool in the oven to set the paint. And then I distressed them and added, you know, some jute twine around the rim and uh, the bows. Well, I'm back. And, you know, while I was um, filming and showing you guys my... Uh, my little updates on my finds um, and looking around my living room I thought it would be kind of neat if I um, did a little impromptu tour of my living room 
to show off all of my thrifted finds. So I'm going to turn the camera around and give you guys a peek at my living room and my treasure trove of thrifted finds. Okay, so I figured I would start right here um, with this beautiful uh, tea cart that I uh, purchased at the Salvation Army for $20. Um, and everything, pretty much everything on it are thrifted items. Um, down below here, I have a collection of little uh, cat teapots. I have a cake stand that I just stuck there because I don't know where I want to put it yet. I have that beautiful crock that was thrifted. And then coming up on top, the two candle holders that you see there were thrifted. The tray, which is one of my most favorite uh, pieces that I thrifted. Uh, if you remember these little, uh, I forgot, little vases um, I had in my last thrift. This plate here is an antique. That was my grandmother's. I just love it. The colors are gorgeous. Um, I made the mason jars. Up here, though, is my milk glass collection. Um, these pieces I got at an estate sale um, from a man who wasn't uh, a collector. Okay. Then we go around. This piece here is a thrifted piece. Uh, these candle holders are thrifted. Then we come over here on this wall, and as you can see, like I said, I love sunflowers. Um, those pictures actually I bought from um, Country Door, along with the uh, sconces on the wall right over here. But uh, yes, all these milk glass pieces were thrifted either at the Goodwill, the Salvation Army, or that um, collector's estate sale. A vase up there. Those old books underneath the clock were also thrifted at the estate sale. Same with the ones on the top shelf there. Okay, and this sign here, um, I thrifted at the Goodwill. And it was just dark wood and I painted it, distressed it, and um, uh, painted the lettering uh, to make it pop. And then I added some uh, faux cotton stems and some uh, magnolia flowers. And down here is another thrifted uh, milk glass item. This is actually an Avon piece, but it's missing the top. Uh, it, it's like a little decanter, but it's missing the top. And I also have these beautiful blue plates that I thrifted at the Goodwill, along with these uh, candles, which are uh, from the Salvation Army. More of the really old um, books from the estate sale. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Over here, we have my beautiful milk glass scale. Uh, that I got at the collector's estate sale along with the candle holders and the plates and I do have more of the plates um, packed away I believe I got like six altogether and um, I got that really pretty planter and the candle holder there the two the milk glass bowls oh there's me and my family before my dad passed away. That was quite a few years back. Uh, another milk glass uh, goblet. And there is the darn lamp that's cracked <laughs> that I hauled. Uh, my beautiful planter. Love that. It's so pretty. That's a Royal Copley planter. And then, of course, here's the two um, candlestick holders that I got at the Salvation Army that I love. And this table, 
I got at the Salvation Army for $10. It's beautiful. And my coffee table here uh, was actually a find that I got at the Salvation Army. It was $20 and it was half price day, so I got it for $10. And as you can see, I chalk painted it and I distressed it. And I love how it turned out. And I thrifted that little lantern there. And more milk glass, my candy dish. I wonder if my son ate all the candy. Oh no, there's still some left. Holy cow, there is a god. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> oh, and then I got that really pretty milk glass piece. Yeah. So that about does it for, anyways, for my, my living room. Um, actually, let's uh, make a quick trip down the hallway really, really quick. And I just wanted to show you guys, I've turned the light on here, um, the shelf that I thrifted in one of my, uh, the last couple videos. And um, I hung it up in my hallway uh, below my farmhouse sign and uh, put my thrifted roosters and, and my cow and uh, the pig actually I got at uh, Dollar General. Um, and the farmhouse sign I actually won in a giveaway on YouTube. Free is good, I love free. Yep, so that about does it. So I hope you guys enjoyed that little impromptu tour um, of my living room and my collection of milk glass and all my little treasures that I have thrifted um, over the last month or so. And um, actually the estate sale items um, I thrifted last summer. Um, but I definitely had to share them with you because they are beautiful, beautiful pieces. Um, and I also wanted to say that the um, farmhouse sign that I won uh, came from the channel Keeping Up With Miss Electra. Uh, she has a great channel. She does DIYs. She does hauls. Uh, she does farmhouse decor. And she is just an awesome person. I love her channel. So please make sure that you check her out. Uh, if you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And please subscribe to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in my next one. Bye.